Yo guys, what's going on? Yes, 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 we're back again. It's a new week. We're pumped, we're energized, we're refreshed, we're rejuvenated. Yes, this is Gusto News on Gusto TV Africa. Thank you guys so much for everything you do. We love you and we truly, truly appreciate you on the 100. Hope your weekend was good, hope your weekend was chilled. Sure you got time to rest and hope you had a good time. Anyways, the week is back and yes, yes, we're going to give you a short recap of what happened over the weekend. Ha! Oh my, what is happening in the music scene? From Afrobeat artists giving themselves gas boosts to rappers giving themselves gas boosts. Wow, that's a lot. Anyway, Sarkodie is in the news today. We have Sarkodie on the news. We have Dremo. We have Kabex. We have Dandizi. And we have Odogu himself, Borna, Boy, and Charlie Poppy. Let's start with Odogu. We know yesterday uh, we celebrated Mother's Day, you know, worldwide, um, especially in Nigeria. And it was a really, really good one. Everyone wishing their mothers happy Mother's Day, you know, gifting their mothers. I saw a trend of people sending money to their mothers, you know, on Twitter, on X. You know, people sending 3 million, 5 million, 100k, as much as they have, you know, to give out to their mother. This is like, okay, just to show that they truly love and care for the mother. Another person that showed this big gesture was Odogu himself. Yes, Bonap Boy. Now, Bonap Boy got his mom a May back and himself a May back. Like, bro, one for his mom, one for himself. We know Bonap Boy, you know, has gotten a fleet of cars, you know, um, a, a while ago. And a May back happens to be one of them, the May back truck. Right now, he got a brand new one for his mother. You could check, you know, from the clip, his own has a plate number, which is registered, means he's had it for a while. But he got the same replica, the black, for his mom. Likewise, you know, to celebrate the Mother's Day. And this is really, really, you know, good to see. I, a lot of people came up on Twitter to say audio car. And then they showed Bonner Boy and the mom driving the car to show that, yes, it is not audio. It is real it is factual you know bonner boy you know he's back in lagos and he loves enjoying himself i think secret place is another place that bonner boy likes to go you know whenever he's in nigeria lagos especially um last weekend it was a secret upper weekend rather it was a secret place you know he gifted tony tesula some money yesterday again over the weekend it was a secret place as well you know he went there with charlie poppy they had a good time you know gisting having fun charlie bobby posted on his snapchat collecting more wisdom from odogu and you know before then i think it was how we started bonaboy was on live you know talking and gisting and having fun with his fan and then charlie poppy happened to call him at that time which was the same time he was on live and they were like yo what's up they're seeing pregnant pleasantries and he was like it's been a long time i've seen you actually now what's up where you at he said he's in lagos say okay now let's pull up uh let's not forget that this time charlie poppy is meant to be on tour you know the joint store with Otomodu Black, but yeah, said he had visa, visa issues, and that is why he is not going on tour. Anyways, Odogu said, "Oh, pull up, let's link up and let's you know have fun." And both of them linked up and they had a good time at Secret Place, you know, talking, gisting, vibing, dancing, and whatnot. Now let's move on to the gas boss. Yes, yes, gas boss. Now Sakodi in preparation for you know his forthcoming album has been doing a lot of you know things uh let's know uh, let's let's also remember that when an artist is going to drop an album definitely they have to you know do a lot of roll-ups roll out rather and everything and this one is titled the championship mixtape mixtape uh, he's done the listening you know um preparation for that um is meant to drop on the 24th of may now on friday he dropped a song titled brag like brag and he literally bragged and dragged a lot of people on this one now on brag he said that oh he's been doing it you know before whiskey came you know to fine tune it and then davido came and then he now listed bonaboy ashake you know on the same list like what this didn't sit down well at with people at all they were like no how would you put odogu in the same list with ashake like bro what's going on why would you say this like why yes you can say oh you've been doing this before whiskey came to fight tuning we're doing this before um davido came up and all of that but he said bonner boy ashake and co and this didn't sit down well with nigerians at all 
like well the song is titled brag so what you expect him to do it meant to brag and you know at the end he said that oh he's been he's he's you know um um on 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 a lane with them kendrick and Kwan. people were like bro you've even been rapping before kendrick lamar so what are you even saying you know kendrick and cole and and the likes and we said he's been doing it before you know whiskey came to you know transform it bonaboy black sheriff ashake and this didn't sit down sit down with a lot of people and that was the beginning of the dragging you know when you drop brag and then you are being dragged like that's 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 a lot now after that happened david Doe went ahead to tweet dremo like with the iphone calling him shouting his name dremo like where are you and sakodi re- sakodi replied link please hmm because i felt like sakodi knew that you know that was that was his call out you know when david Doe said dremo like i'm calling you my boy you know come through come through come through you know come through on this one come show them you know how it's done and then dremo came up <sighs> he dropped this one on his instagram and he tagged sakodi on it he just said sakodi and he walked away like bro someone commented on sakodi's post he said dremo this this guy you're waiting him they feel like and dremo said hold my beer and boom he came up and he dropped his bath people were like what waiting sakodi go find you know, under the comment section, there was a Shinko Ekun that was saying that I pray another rapper from Ghana replies this. Now that one I go chop immediately. I don't off shit, I de vex. Looking at that, I guess the Ghanaian guy also saw that. I like, okay, eh now, oh yeah, now let's go. And then he dropped his line. You know, lyrical Joe, he fires Adremo. Like he dropped a reply Adremo for replying Sakodi, another Ghanaian artist, you know, trying to fight, you know, for for their boss and as soon as that drops Shinko Ekun, you know now Tiger bro <laughs> he dropped the bars and we were like come on like come on Ghanaian a, a lot he had he had a lot of a lot of lines like a lot of lamba you know if I'm going to be your boss yeah call me Amasi like you no know, um um Charlie like bro he was just dropping a lot of a lot of lines and people were like come on no 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 way no way chinko Ekun. no you finished you finish this one you finish this one like nah this is too hot you know it's like it's it's, it's, it's too hot you know party for foolish people will they find you for front row come on like bro that was it that was that was a lot a lot of a lot of lines you know on that one and people really like that yes yes you know chinko you know is killing it like bro he murdered he murdered him and then that was not even the end all of a sudden dandizi came in a now deleted video calling out kabex you know for i don't know what transpired within them but then he's called him out he's dragged him you know another distract and kabex saw this were like oh i was chilling on my own no then he started from portacourt called him out and he fire shot at dan dizzy he even spelled his name d for this a for this i for this like bro Kabes was really 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 on fire like it was really hot and while he was dropping his lines shots were fired at odumodu so sorry <laughs> so sorry about that but then it just had to happen and then dan dizzy came up again this morning with a cheesy reply he said i'm done and people were like bro what is this like what is this why would you drop this like out of all the things you first off deleted the first you know video that he made even though he's still you know, up on social media right now and then you're now dropping this as a response nah 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 like nah this is a lot of people like were so disappointed like no this is 1.5 this is 0.2 this is nah this one is like why would you say be quack 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 like bro you know you know more like turning it to you know some bigotry you know stuff someone is an indigenous rapper you wrapped you wrap your stuff in pidgin and english he's indigenous he raps in yoruba like it doesn't even mean he can't speak pidgin but then everyone knows kabex is an indigenous rapper so he replied you back in yoruba and you expect him to reply in english really like why didn't you fire a shot at an artist that raps in the dialect that you want you know this is his zone so it gives you back his response you are now you know trying to you know come at him for that and all of that but nah come on the response from dan dizzy wasn't you know sitting well with nigerians and they told him straight up like bro nah nah go back go back go back to the studio you don't have to do this at all you know if that goes continue we're looking forward to you know the next one anyways dremo has said that it's all love 
you know ghana and niger love always and dream also said that them rappers can't have fun anymore y'all suck stock up and boring you know like it's just a a a a a a a a way to have fun and all of that nothing serious it's all love you know, like you know rap is just you know at times you just add some ginger and spice to everything to make it all good anyways let's look forward to you know sakodi's album that's going to drop in a bit and fingers crossed maybe we could even have collaborations from dremo and tinkweko on this one who knows you know when an album is going to drop everybody is going to do different prs and different ways to promote the album fingers crossed on this one we'll catch you guys on the very next one see you Thank you.